Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to our Wednesday where we share words of wisdom. Please like, comment, share, and or subscribe to my YouTube channel, Kalia Patton. Now we're going to go on into our topic for today. Our topic for today is don't forget your umbrella. Don't forget your umbrella. We know what an umbrella is. An umbrella is used and it is designed to help you to stay dry when it's wet outside. Sometimes people use them even in the summertime when you're out on the beach or if you're out uh, watching a game and it may be sweltering hot and the umbrella will protect you from those rays, those sun rays. But I want to talk about how if you utilize your umbrella, that it will protect you from storms and things that may come and arise in your life. Because guess what? There will be some good days. There will be some bad days. There will be some days that will be challenging for you. There will be some days where you want to feel like uh, you just want to give up. You know, you, you've run out of options, you've, you've turned here, you've turned there, and you have made the decision that you no longer want to do this anymore. I am through. I am done. This is it. But how many of you know that your umbrella is something that can provide security, safety? You know, uh, it will protect you from the storm. It will protect you from the rain. Uh, I know a friend of mine, and she mentioned this to me. And she was going through challenge after challenge after challenge, and everything was coming at her at one time. And she said, well, that's why I carry my umbrella for times like this. And that was so profound. And I find myself wrestling and challenging Uh, with that statement because I too have gone through some things and I'm currently going through some things um, that has kind of taken me by surprise. They were unexpected. Some unexpected challenges in family, uh, dealing with family, dealing with job, dealing with issues that, you know, we all have dealt with it. We are all currently probably dealing with things. And sometimes they're unexpected attacks. There are unexpected things that happen to us. And we have to know that that umbrella is needed in times like this. Don't forget your umbrella. (laughs) You know, a lot of times, you know, um, when we tell our children, uh, don't forget to brush your teeth. Don't forget to uh, put your coat on. Don't forget to do this. Don't forget to do that. You know, you can think of all of these things that you tell your children not to forget to do. But oftentimes we fail to remember the things that have held us, the things that have grounded us, the things that have kept us through storms, through tests, through trials, through trauma, you know, through hurts. And it has been that umbrella. You know, and so I'm going to go into a few scriptures. Genesis chapter 7, verse 12, and then Matthew chapter 7, verse 25. Genesis chapter 7, verse 12, it says, And the rain was upon the earth 40 days and 40 nights. That's a long time. And if you're outside in a storm, if you're currently, and I'm not just talking about outside, you know, I'm just using that as a descriptor, but you can have a storm that can last for days, weeks, and maybe even months. But if you don't have your umbrella, guess what? You, you you're gonna you're gonna be taken over by the storm. <laughs> you're 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 gonna be swept into the storm. You you're gonna be brought into it, and 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 you're gonna be swerving in it. You're gonna go through the waves. You're gonna be tossing and turning. And, and you're just going to be engulfed in the storm. But if you carry your umbrella, if you can just remember to carry your umbrella, it won't get you caught up. It will secure you. you. It will provide safety for you. So it doesn't matter how long 
You have to endure something. It doesn't matter how long you have to go through it, but as long as you carry your umbrella, and you know who I'm talking about. I'm talking about Jesus. We, 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 we're referencing umbrella, but we, we're talking about the Lord. You know, you got to carry him everywhere you go. <laughs> you got to carry him everywhere you go because the storms are coming and sometimes they take us by surprise. Sometimes we don't know those clouds just change all of a sudden, just like you blinked your eyes and, oh man, wow. We've entered into a storm. We're in a tornado storm. We're in a we're in a hurricane. We we the earthquakes coming. Whatever kind of storm may be going on in your life, you need to carry something that's gonna secure you while you're going through the storm. Something that's gonna provide safety and shelter for the storm. Don't forget your umbrella. Matthew chapter 7 verse 25 and it reads and the rain descended and the floods came and the winds blew and beat upon that house and it fell not for it was founded upon a rock who's that rock <laughs> Jesus is the rock you know he is our safety he is our security he is our strong tower he is the unmovable thing in our life, the unchangeable thing in our life. When things happening and it's spiraling out of control, it, it appears that it's spiraling out of control. Jesus is the only safe and constant thing, the only unchangeable thing that is in our life at that moment. And he wants you to be assured that he's going to take good care of you. He wants you to know that he's there. Okay. He wants you to know that he's your ever present help in the time of trouble. You may be in some trouble. You may be going through some things, but God said, I'm there. I am your ever present, ever present help. I, I'm always present. I'm always available. But I need you to acknowledge the fact that I'm always here and I'm always available. Don't forget your umbrella. Don't forget your umbrella because storms are coming. Mm -hmm. The rain is coming. <laughs> that tornado is coming. That hurricane is coming. That typhoon, it is coming. Okay? You got to have some preparation. You, you better be prepared for that. If you have your umbrella, if Jesus is your security, your safety, your umbrella in your storm, then you need to acknowledge the fact that he is there and lean, trust, and depend on him because he's present. He's present in the storm. You know, you may be focusing on the storm. You're focusing on the roaring winds. You're focusing on that rain that's beating down, beating down, beating down. You're focusing on the fact that things are changing. God said, I'm here. When the disciples were in the boat, the boat was rocking. The boat was shaking. It was some turmoil going on. So they were so concerned. They woke Jesus up. They woke Jesus up. Can you calm the storm? Hmm. He said, why, why, why do you wake me? Why? At such a time as this. When, do you not trust me? I'm in the boat with you. <laughs> I'm in the boat with you. Can you not trust me? That I'm in the boat with you? So now you waking me. You have awakened me out of my sleep and slumber. Okay, all right. <laughs> let, let, let me just handle this. So Jesus said, he rebuked the winds. He said, peace be still. And guess what? The storm ceased. The waves start slowing up. Because Jesus just spoke to him. He told the storm. To pass, to remove itself from there, peace. And so, sometimes when we wrestling with the storm, when when the storms of life hit us, <laughs> challenges hit us, we gotta trust that God is there. 
We can't keep worrying about the issue. We can't keep, keep, keep going to God as if we don't trust him. And he said, don't you have my umbrella? Don't you have my umbrella? I've made my umbrella available to you. Don't you have my umbrella? Yes, yes. Now there are times, there are times, let me tell you something. There are times when you even, when you even carry that umbrella, you may get a little drizzle. You may have a little raindrop hit you here or there. You know, you, it, it may be sprinkles or a mist of, of, of some of the, the storm that may hit you, you know, that may woo, cause you to feel, you know, cold or feel a certain way, you know, in your emotions or, or physically. But don't you know that that umbrella is going to protect you from getting drenched in that storm. It's going to protect you from getting carried away into that storm. Because Jesus said, I'm here. I'm here. I'm present. I'm with you. I'm with you. I just need you to trust me. Just trust me. Don't forget me. Don't forget that I'm in the boat with you. Don't forget that I'm in the storm with you. Don't forget that I'm in the house with you. Don't forget that I'm in the ring with you. Don't forget that I am in your job. Whatever that situation is that you're going through, I'm there with you. I'm not going to leave you alone. I'm not going to leave you without some protection. I'm not going to leave you to fend for yourself. I'm here. I'm here. I'm present. I'm available. Right here. Don't forget about him. Don't forget that umbrella. Don't forget that God is with you. He's with you in this fight. He's with you in this storm. He's with you in this test. He's with you in this lonely period and season of your life. God is with you you take it and apply it take it and apply it wherever it goes wherever it need to go know that Jesus is with you don't forget him don't forget that umbrella you know you know what that rep represents you know what the umbrella represents in your life God gonna carry you through the storm just keep holding on to that umbrella Holding on to the rock, huh? The rock that don't move, the rock that don't change. Hey, the rock that provides protection. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Jesus is a rock. And if you wise, you will build your house upon a rock. If you wise, you will build your house upon a rock. But if you're not wise, you're going to build your house the way you think it should go. And it's not going to be built on the rock. Because <laughs> the rock is the only thing that's going to secure that house. The rock is the only thing that's going to keep that house from shaking in the storm. From getting swept up into the storm. From getting beat down in the storm. That rock is Jesus. We need to make 